Police have identified a missing boater who was pulled from an Auburn reservoir as 56-year-old Douglas Flink, but they still haven't said how he died. Last night, neighbors called 911 after spotting the boat spinning in circles around the Dark Brook Reservoir with no one on board. WBZ's Christina Hager has the latest. He loved being out on Electric Pond, also known as Dark Brook Reservoir. So when neighbors saw 56-year-old Doug Flink out on his motorboat Thursday, it was a familiar sight. What they saw moments later was not. The witness stated that as he was looking out the back of his house, he saw the, the boat doing donuts. He was unsure whether or not the gentleman was still on the boat. Spinning out of control, the roar of the engine woke Rosa Holtberg's son from a nap. He didn't know it was a boat or anything. You know, he just, just heard a noise. There was a boat uh, discovered uh, approximately 300 yards off the shore uh, that was resting on an island. Uh, and there were witness accounts uh, that a victim was in the water. A nighttime search resumed in the morning, this time with a search dog trained to follow scents even through water. And the canine uh, had two different hits on a specific area where divers began to focus. A short time later, uh, the victim was recovered. It's got a lot of weeds. It's, it's not very deep, but the current in the center it's quite strong. Oh, I think it's a tragedy and it's awful. It's awful, awful. According to the district attorney's office, something caused Flink to fall off his motorboat at some point. Neighbors say he was very well known and well liked here in Auburn. Christina Hager, WBZ News. All right, Christina, thank